Hey, it's uh, game 50 is in the books. I mean, you're kind of almost to the two thirds of the way through the season. How do you feel mentally and physically going through the rigors of a season? Uh, I feel good. You know, what I mean, I have a, nothing but confidence in this team. You know, obviously this season has been a whole lot of ups and downs, but it's been a whole lot more ups than it has been downs. I mean, we're still a young group of guys. We're still adding guys. And obviously we got to keep getting everybody adjusted to obviously Pascal get adjusted to us and we get adjusted to him. But overall, I feel as though that we're doing great right now. You can only focus on this one, but you've got six until a break comes. So how important is it to go into this last week and a half, two weeks before the break on a good note? I mean, it's a lot. You know, I mean, obviously around this time, a lot of teams start to check out and just get ready for all-star break and get ready for the rest. Man, that's where you can sneak up on a couple of teams and get a couple of um, losses on them. You know, I mean, obviously we want to be focused going in and making sure that we're executing and staying, staying through it until through the all-star break. Because, I mean, obviously, like I said, this is a big stretch for a lot of teams. You've been kind of battling it back. What's that process been like, and how is it frustrating? Has it been going into games not knowing how you're going to feel? Uh, it's been tough because, I mean, obviously, you, like you say, you just don't know. Sometimes it may feel fine for a couple stretch of games, and then out of nowhere it just, like, you know, tightens up on me, and then I, it's tough to move around on it. But overall, I mean, as long as I keep a positive mindset, you know, I mean, obviously I trust the trainers, and they trust me, and we just continue to keep working from there. Game 50 was uh, last game. That's kind of a mile marker or a point in the season. How do you feel physically and mentally right now? It's um, a great question. I feel uh, I feel filled with emotions. You know, I'm I'm grateful to you know being able to be at game fifty, game going to game fifty one. You know, and stuff like that. But uh, you know, it's not it's not easy to go through fifty games. You know, and stuff like that. So. You know, I'm pretty grateful. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in good shape, in good form. I don't feel like last year you ever hit that rookie wall, but going through it a second season is the grind of the season maybe easier to to get through. For sure. I mean, you know, you 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 start, um, you know, playing, and you know, you pretty much know what to expect, you know, and stuff like that. I feel like last year, you know, we didn't. I feel like the situation, you know, we couldn't make the playoffs, but this year we definitely have a good chance of making the playoffs. Not only making the playoffs, but having it, you know, a deep run. Um, so I feel like that's the fun part about it. You know, we have a great team. Uh, you know, we have a better team this year. We have a lot of guys on the team, you know, who are who's able to to uh, to produce. I feel like that's the beauty of it. So in some ways, last year you get to the All Star break. Ty had been hurt, and you were falling down the standings. It was maybe a little harder. Now you have that motivation of playoffs. For sure, hundred percent. You know, like you said, we, like I said earlier, you know, we have we have a good team, and you know, we have guys who are ready to come and play. Um, whether I'm out, you know, where the tie is out or, you know, the rest of the team. So uh, I feel like that's that's pretty much the blessing, of, the blessing of, of, of the team. And, you know, um, I'm just looking forward to play the next game. Not used to seeing you on the injury report. How hard was it to miss those two games this week? It was hard, man. It was really hard. I feel like, um, you know, if it was a decision up to myself, I would definitely be playing those games. But, you know, I also got to make the smart move, you know, uh, knowing that, you know, we have a lot of guys on the team who can step up, who can be ready for next game and, you know, give me time to recover and come back for the team. Toes can linger. They can be painful to come back and then score 31 and look like there were no ill effects. Could you take me through that night? No, I mean, you know, for like the game, just trying to keep the game simple. You know, I was out for a couple of games, gave me time to, you know, to think about, you know, how to see the defense was going to play me when I come back and felt like my shots were falling in. Um, you know, but the most important thing for me was to, you know, to, to win the game. It's, you know, it's the, more, the most important thing. I can score 50, score 60, but if I, if I don't win the game, then there's nothing to it. Tonight's uh, an important game to win after you've lost three straight. What do you view as a key tonight? Um, Just got to contain, contain the paint. You know, we they have a lot of great players, but, you know, we have to we have to remain as a team. And, you know, tonight's a great opportunity for us to, to go back into the, you know, the winning streak and, um, you know, just, just have, a, have a good month.